Hello everybody, my name is Bojangles and welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Family Pizzeria looking for security guard to work the night shift. Monitor cameras, ensure safety of equipment, and animatronic, animatronic characters. Now I know this game has been... I know the third game actually came out recently, and I've been watching videos about that, but... The fact that they had, that Scott Cawthorn um, had three games within a year come out is just amazing. And I'm not going to interrupt these phone calls, so if I'm quiet, just... Hello? Hello? Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact, so I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm here to tell you there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll be fine. So let's just focus on getting you through your first week, okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. And it's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or person. Upon discovering that damage or death has occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. Now, that might sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing those same stupid songs for 20 years and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children and we need to show them a little respect, right? Okay. So just be aware, the characters do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servos locking up, they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too. But then there was the bite of 87. Yeah. It's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe, you know? Uh, now, concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, they'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, now, that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wired, and animatronic devices especially around the facial area. So you can imagine how having your head forcefully pressed inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort and death. Uh, the only parts of you that would like to see the line of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth and pop up in front of the mask. <laughs> yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first day should be a breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. You gotta conserve power. Alright, good night. Okay, I guess he's finally done. Um. Oh. Oh, shit. Who's moving? Who's moving? Who's the word? Hi. Okay, so th there are names of these animatronics. The, the purple bunny, his name is Bonnie. Um, and there's Chica the chicken and Freddy the bear. I don't know. Why everyone's names matches except for Freddy's. But there's one thing in this first game in particular I want you guys to notice. Um, and it's this. You guys can't see my mouse probably, but there's this poster right here that says Rules for Safety. I've read that that changes throughout the nights. And what it pretty much says is um, what happened here pertaining to four children. And then there's another poster, where is it? Um, this poster too, the Let's Party one with Freddy on it, that one is actually for Golden Freddy to come out. I know this 
because it happened to me one time while I was playing long when it first came out, and I wanted to know what had happened. Oh, hi! Hi, Cheek. Oh, no. Where's Bonnie? Okay, Bonnie's there. Cheek is there. Freddy's just not moving. Oh, and there's also another, there's a fourth animatronic. His name, her name is Foxy, the pirate fox. And she is in Pirate Cove, but she doesn't really, she's not really active the first night, as far as I'm aware. But this game is supposedly one of the scariest games to come out in years. And arguably, I would agree with people. Some people think it's not scary. Some people do. It's it all depends on your perspective. But the main objective of this game is to really just make sure that they don't come in in here and uh, apparently stuff you into an endoskeleton from what the film guy was saying. They're not really moving. And you only have a set amount of power. Like I know I only have 40%. At, on night, but this is night one night. It uh, gets harder as you go. Where is he? Oh, he hauled ass. He hauled ass. Um. Chica. Okay, I can only assume that Chica's in uh, the kitchen. For some reason, doesn't have. A camera but like I was saying um, you only have a set amount of power to do this and as you can see I have 30% left but that's only because I know what to do oh hey Chica oh that is scary but only because I know what to do is you don't want, like, even looking at this camera, like, you see the usage go up and down as I click in and out of the cameras and turn on the lights and shut doors. But, well, mainly, each hour is roughly a few minutes. So, as the nights get longer, you want to use less and less power. And I've come down to where you should use about 20% per hour. And that's if you want to survive. God. Sheikah scares me. With her teeth. Where do you go? Ah! Hey, 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 hey. Close the door! He's still, yeah, he's still there. And you can see, like, that little shadow. That's how I tell when Bonnie's gone. He's still there. Um, I think this is just going to be, I'm going to do each episode by nights, just because it's easier for me, and I'm pretty sure you guys would like to see just one night at a time, but I'm going to try to space them out and hopefully get done with each video as fast as I can, because I know that there are seven nights to this game. Okay, that was beautiful. Um, is he still there? No. But there's seven nights, there's a sixth night, and then a custom night. And I know that the third game came out, and people have been playing that left and right. Okay, so he's there. She's there. But I'm going to try my best to get the games out as fast as I can. Woo! First night's done. Um. I know this is going right into the second night, but thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video.